it's Emma from Travel Soft Food. I've never made a video before, so this is my first video. Hello. Um, I thought I would make a video instead of my usual posts where it's image, text, image, text. So um, I'm just going to do a list of all the things I like for Christmas. Cheap presents that I think would be nice for kind of foodie people or there's some other ones in there. So you might like it, you might not, but uh, just stick with me if you want. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I'm going to talk about is Coco Cafe. Um, I'm actually addicted to this at the moment. It's a coffee drink mixed with coconut water and I got it in Holland and Barrett. It's about three euro and if you, they have an offer at the moment. If you buy one you get one half price and I just thought they'd be nice for a stocking filler because like um, coconuts and coffee together at last. <laughs> what could be better than that? <laughs> So I think they'd be really good, they're, you can buy them on Amazon, like they're in dollars at the moment so I'd say you can only get them in America so be a different unique gift and be a nice stocking filler, it's relatively cheap so I would get this. The next thing I'm going to talk about is a Lotus Caramelized Biscuit Spread, it's insane, I can't believe this exists or it's actually they're called Speckloos I think in France but um, I was on um, Keddie's blog the other day, French Foodie in Dublin. It's a brilliant blog, a French uh, girl, she lives in Dublin, she reviews cafes, restaurants here. That girl's going to bankrupt me because everything she, she, suge she suggests, she suggests I have to go there, I have to go there. Um, so she wrote about this the other day, she got it in Fallon and Burn, so I immediately had to go and get it. Um, she also put a recipe up for this um, to make a chocolate and speckly log, which is an insanely good idea. Um, so I think this would be really good to buy people as gifts, especially if people are food freaks like me and they really like this spread because if I got this in my stocking I'd be like, yeah. Now I'm going to put away these cool, delicious gifts and talk about paper gifts. Uh, first one is the Dining Room Dolly. They do meals, tapas, drink, drink, drinks, drinks <laughs> for, from 12 euro, euro to 60 euro we'll say you could spend. Um, because who doesn't want a night out or a day out if they have kids especially but they're very plain, the voucher themselves the vouchers themselves so I'd probably like whack out the colouring pencils, markers stickers, glitter <laughs> paint <laughs> and just colour them in myself or like you know make my own design them. that's a bit cheesy but I don't care they're too plain, then I put them into a card that would be a really good gift they're also great for last minute gifts because uh, you literally put your credit card details in buy the voucher and then you print it out I literally, I went for one recently to Brasserie 7 in town, it was delicious. Um, I gave somebody a gift for their birthday and they actually took me. So <laughs> it worked out for me as well. So that might happen for you as well if you buy a voucher. But um, yeah, so I also got, I usually get them and grab one as well. Um, grab one has some more foodie stuff this for Christmas as well. They have the vouchers but they also have a hamper for about 75 euro, excuse me. And it's Cadbury's, Lines, Tato, just a huge big hamper which would be good for families or kids. Um, they also have beauty stuff, getting away from food. They have a beauty box with loads of brands in it for 25 euro. It's Calvin Klein, Elizabeth Arden, just loads of other ones in it. But they also have um, a mascara and lash extension set for 12 euro as well, so that'd be good. Um, present and not too expensive either. So, ah! <laughs> okay. Um, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, I was in Boots the other day, and they have loads of Soap and Glory stuff. Um, three for two. If you didn't want to spend too much, you could go for you know three three Soap and Glory things and tie them up with a ribbon. What? Soap and Glory. <laughs> Start again. Start again. Cool. <laughs> Okay, more beauty stuff, more obviously travel style food is more food stuff, but uh, beauty stuff. I was in Boots the other day and there was a huge queue, huge, where Soap and Glory is, and there always is, and rightly so. There was like, the, the two days I went in a row, yeah, I went there twice. Um, why did I say that? <laughs> oh man, okay. <laughs> yes, yeah, so there was a huge queue there. That stuff was amazing, smells amazing. I just want to eat it. Um, so if you don't want to buy it, <laughs> The sets of Soap and Glory are huge, but they're really expensive. They're like 75 euro. So if you wanted to get three for two, you know, you'd save a bit, but you would get you can get the good products. I got a set last year which was fantastic. At the time I think it was called All Stars. It's more or less the same this year. It's called um, the Yule Monty. It's 77.50, which is a lot. So if you wanted to just do three for two, you could pick the 
the best products out of it really. I actually have ones here with me that I liked, ones I liked, ones I wasn't crazy about. So if you want to take my advice on what I liked and what I didn't. The Righteous Butter is the first one that came in the set. Um, it's nearly gone. Well, maybe I'll ask for one this Christmas. Um, I have really bad eczema. I've written about that before in posts. This doesn't irritate my skin at all. None of the soap and glory products do. But this is fantastic. It's really moisturising and it smells really nice. So that is definitely my, one of my favourites out of the set. This one as well. Sugar Crush. This exfoliator. Oh my god. It's like sugary limey or something. It smells so good. I always use this and this doesn't um, irritate my eczema either, which is good. Anyway. Uh, so that was in the set as well and it's in the same one as well. But these ones look big, so they're bulk as a gift. So you're like, look what I got you. And they're huge. So. <laughs> this one as well, Peaches and Clean uh, Cleansing Milk. It's supposed to be really good for taking off makeup. I just take, use it for washing my face in the shower, but I actually haven't tried it for makeup. But it's really good, it smells like peaches. Uh, really wakes you up in the morning. It has a bit of a minty smell as well, but it's fantastic. I'm definitely going to buy this again, and I would recommend this one. And it's in the new side as well, I think, but again, if you want to get it on its own, I think it's, it's less than 15 euro anyway. Heal Genius and Hand Food are both fantastic for hands and feet. They're really good as well. The only thing is, I only use a small bit of the hand food because if I pick up things afterwards, they do tend to slip out of my hands. But um, they're really good as well, so they're worth the money. This I really like, the Smoothie Star. It's really moisturising as well, it's very good. Um, when that stuff runs out I use it, but the only thing I really don't like about this is you actually smell like breakfast all day. Like you smell like Weetabix mixed with banana and... Yeah, I don't like it. Moving on to their beauty stuff that are usually in the sets as well. I wouldn't really recommend buying Soap and Glory beauty stuff. Sorry, I just wouldn't. It's not good. Well, I had the lipstick sexy mother pucker and that was good. A bit sticky though, um, but this I really didn't like. It's thick and fast, that comes in nearly all the sets. It just doesn't do anything. It's dry, it's, it's just not a good mascara. I wouldn't waste my money on it to be honest, and I don't want you to waste yours either. Okay, so that's my food stuff and my beauty stuff. Um, that's just my opinion, I might not know anything. This is my first video, so. Thank you for watching and hopefully my nerves didn't show through too much. Um, one last thing I have to actually have to say, this jumper, in case you're wondering, kind of Christmassy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I got this in Awear in Swords and it was on sale from I think it was 30 euro to 15. Then they have an offer where it's 20% off, further 20% off. So I got it for 12 euro. They have Lowe's dress at the moment and there's a discount so you could get that for yourself or for a gift. So yeah. That's basically all I have to say. They're just my recommendations and I hope you like my video and yeah, okay, bye. <laughs>